My name is Thierry Nas. I'm a hospital practitioner working at the BSET Hospital in the Paris suburbs. And I'm also running a research team dedicated to emergent uh, antimicrobial resistant traits. Diagnostics are a key issue in the fight against antimicrobial resistance because with diagnostic tools we will be able to identify very rapidly patients that are either carriers or that are infected with these multidrug resistant bacteria and this is of course in order to prevent the spread of these bacteria in the hospital settings. Carbapenems and cholestine are considered as last resort molecules. Carbapenems are among the molecules that are used in many ICUs as the jokers because you know that these molecules are usually effective when all the others fail. Of course, when bacteria become resistant to carbapenems, then you are in a kind of for trouble. And then that's when you use cholestine, which is the very last resort antibiotic to be used. There are several methods that allow you to infer whether a patient is a carrier of a carbapenemase producing bacteria. You have phenotypic tests, which take 24 to 48 hours, which is very long for hygiene and for infection control measures. You have other tests, which take three to four hours, which again is, is quite long. And then you have molecular tests, which are usually very rapid. And the faster, the easier it is to identify a patient easier to isolate the patient and prevent the spread of the bacteria to eventually other patients. There are currently five main carbapenemases spreading in uh, most of the clinical settings worldwide. However, there are some minor carbapenemases that are also prevalent. Therefore, the more of these variants or the more of these enzymes you will detect, the better it is, because you cannot afford missing one or two patients just because your assay is not including their targets. So the more you detect, the better it is. The Novodiac Carba R assay is a molecular assay that detects the five main carbapenemases, which account for 99% of the carbapenemases spreading in uh, the clinical settings, but also it detects four carbapenemases which are encountered in Acinetobacter bomaniae, which is another hospital based pathogen, and also it detects MCR1, which is a cholestine uh, plasmid encoded resistant determinant. We have evaluated the performances, biological performances of the Novodiag Carba R assay, and we found that this assay meets perfectly well the French epidemiology of carbapenemases. Mainly, it detects perfectly well the five main carbapenemases, but it also detects the carbapenemases encountered in Acinetobacter bomaniae with nearly 100% specificity and nearly 100% sensitivity. Rapid diagnostics such as the CARBA R assay are useful for identifying patients that are carriers and to increase the infection control measures or even uh, isolate the patients or uh, cohorting the patients in a dedicated unit in order to prevent the bacteria to spread to other patients. But also it will help you to use the right antibiotics to treat the infections. Currently, the new antibiotics will work only on certain um, resistance mechanism and by using molecular assay you will be able to know which is the resistance mechanism and which antibiotic you may use to treat efficiently the infection.